Greetings, Scorpio. This is your weekly 8th through the 14th. Let's see what's going on. This is for your rising sun, moon, Venus, Jupiter, Cuspids, cross watches. Y'all know the drill. Take what resonates, leave the rest. All right. I got, I'm going to have my extended on my website, kimarts.org, where you just register for zero, but you pay on Patreon to get the extended readings to these weekly, all right? So make sure you guys uh, sign up on Patreon. Look for Kim Arts, K-E-M-A-R-T-S, and pay there to get the uh, the extended, okay? All right. So I didn't want y'all to think that it was free because it's zero on my website. I didn't want y'all paying twice. So again, uh, there you go, Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo, Scorpios, let's see what's going on with y'all this week. Ooh, hot mama summer, working hard for the money, and your manifestations are paying off. All right, somebody is in love with hot mama summer. Somebody's uh, manifestations are coming in. They're abundance. They're shining. They're glowing wherever they go. All right. Uh-oh, y'all got a Gemini Libra Aquarius, baby. Somebody is thinking about y'all. Oh, somebody is being malicious, huh, around y'all. Scorpios, let's see what's going on here. Y'all moving on, packing your bags, and you're leaving, all right? Somebody's on the move. Somebody's trying to keep you there. Uh-oh, somebody's guarded, too, with the two of swords. Uh-oh, y'all got a victory. Uh-oh, 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 uh-oh. Scorpio in that si victory and that success. What else is coming in for the Scorpios this week? Ooh, a tower moment, a news flash. All right, oh, yeah. News flash, powwow, break it down. Could be an argument somewhere. Oh, a fight breaking out, maybe. Judgment day in reverse. This person has not changed. Somebody's coming back around, uh, pretending uh, with you guys. We got that sun Leo is going to illuminate whatever this conflict is. Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Somebody could be trying to start something, a fight or argument. Y'all going to be moving on from this person, possibly with that six of sword. King of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Uh, the world card, Tars. You guys are going to be possibly traveling around the world. Oh, celebrations. All right. Celebrate. Come on. Let's celebrate. All right. Baby, it's going to be a good time tonight. Let's celebrate. It's all right. Oh, I'm loving this. King of Cups. Celebration. Ten of Pentacles. You guys got some stability. You guys are investing in yourself and your emotional balance and happiness. You guys are definitely uh, in for some stability in here. Maybe ready for a reconciliation with somebody, huh? Or somebody is, yeah, but y'all a little guarded. So y'all like, I ain't sharing my shit. Look at there. Uh-uh. Not with no haters. Y'all gonna be walking away from somebody. Y'all are guarded, uh, protecting your happiness your emotional stability, and there's a lot of competition around you guys with some people that are not ready to change, okay, uh, that's starting all this commotion, talking about you uh, behind your back, people that are in their lower self. So, Scorpio, y'all got a lot of people that's operating in their lower nature here. You guys need to look at who y'all are hanging around because these are some malicious people, like, they're devious. They're not trying to, uh, King, Queen of Swords, Gemini, Libra, Chris, this is somebody that's talking behind y'all back. Somebody that's stirring up some trouble. Yeah, look at that. Y'all manifesting. Y'all in Aquarius uh, manifesting mode, but somebody's talking shit behind y'all back. Yeah, look at that. Somebody can't sleep. Uh-huh. Somebody having uh, dreams and nightmares. Very conflicted. Uh, possibly this person did a lot of envious stuff behind your back. Yep, y'all looking over y'all future. Y'all are making plans for y'all future. That's the overall card. You got a decision to make. You guys got to leave all that betrayal behind. You know, make a decision about your future. Do what's best for y'all with that ten of wands. Drop worrying about what other people are doing behind their back. If they want to live in the lower nature, let them live in the lower nature, Scorpio. Let them have it. This person is closed off. This person angry and mad, upset because y'all are celebrating. Y'all got a reconciliation, three of cups at the heart of the matter. There's a lot of conflict. Uh, Queen of Swords, Gemini, the Aquarius. This person is keeping up a lot of shit. Can't sleep, having nightmares, stalking. Uh, again, uh, anxiety and worry. What are they worried about, Spirit? What is y'all? What is y'all? Let me get back. Let me get that card. Yeah. Oh, yeah. They tied up in their head like Fred and Frida. Well, yeah. What are they worried about, Spirit? Yeah. They, they're in mental conflict because of the way they did y'all look. Feel like y'all are walking away. What? Thinking about y'all planning a future without them. Y'all got some choices. Three, three of cups. Three of third party here. 
Y'all may be walking away from this conflict. Yep, waiting on some ships to come in, waiting on something you've been investing in, waiting, uh, having some options. You guys are walking towards your options. You want to explore your options. You're tired of waiting for somebody to, to grow the fuck up. All right, this person's not growing the fuck up. They, they full of conflict. Look at there, y'all going after y'all wish fulfillment. Y'all like, I ain't got time for this shit. Nope. Look at that. You, I ain't got time for mind games. What? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Grease Lightning. Grease Lightning coming in there. Yep. Y'all got the balance y'all need and the courage to go after y'all dreams and wish fulfillment. Take the lead with that Knight of Wands. Uh, you guys could have been, been gaslighted with a lot of options. Look, a lot of choices and y'all happiness with that Ten of Cups. Oh, yeah. Y'all thinking about making, get, letting go of those options and choices that y'all have for y'all ten of cups. All right, y'all trying to see who's the best suitor for happiness, for marriage, uh, for a union, to build a home and a family with. Some of you Scorpios may be moving. You guys may be thinking about moving and relocating. Oh yeah, looking for your soulmate, six of cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. What? Well, victory and success is coming in. Y'all got courage and confidence. Things are gonna start moving a little steadier you're you're uh you're gonna have a lot of communication a positive communication you guys are going to be opening up that throat chakra speaking y'all mind and what y'all want and y'all desires and making sure that y'all are stable with your emotions okay y'all gonna be balancing out y'all your emotions y'all are probably gonna be very vocal <laughs> y'all gonna be probably very very vocal uh coming up in here within the week okay lots of communication coming in Okay, be careful not to just be in a combat mode or aggressive mode, you know, um, argumentative mode. You don't have to compete. You don't owe anybody no explanation. You know, y'all just live y'all life. That's all y'all got to do. Look at there. Y'all got Cupid's arrows coming in, fast decisions coming in. A lot of choices and options are coming in towards y'all. A lot of abundance. A lot of things y'all are working on at one time. Let's see. What else, Spirit? For our Scorpios. What's coming in for our Scorpios? Oh, Lord. They don't even want to talk. Got a Virgo under there. And working hard. Oh, move my candle out. Got a Virgo and working hard. Oh, what we got here? Working hard and Scorpio showing up for their own reading. So, y'all got a... Uh, 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 y'all have finished a, another project. Okay, y'all got a Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. So y'all have finished a project. You know, y'all are end of working hard, focusing, whatever y'all need to focus on. That's life, death, and rebirth here. Uh, again, an ending to this hard work. Y'all finished up a cycle, and y'all got that victory coming in now with that Eight of Pentacles. Uh, some of y'all may lose some work, possibly an end to some work. Charge Capricorn Virgo. Okay, maybe an end, or y'all gonna be reinventing something about work. Yeah, look at that. Protecting yourself uh, again from the breadcrumbers, from the penny pinchers and the penny slickers. Yep, y'all starring up. So y'all ain't gonna have to work so hard. Okay, somebody could have been breadcrumbing y'all, stringing y'all along, y'all protecting yourself. Uh, again, this person is coming to want to come back around and work with you guys too. All right, somebody's coming back around, want to work with y'all. Tap into your high priestess self. Y'all, some of y'all, use your emotions. You know, follow your intuition. I know Scorpio showing up for their own reading. Look at y'all. What? Victory. What? The Libra uh, justice with the high priestess. Y'all are going after some justice. Look at there. Somebody from y'all past coming back. Want to speak to y'all. Want to clear the air. You guys know some secrets about this person. And this person's trying to defend themselves. So they want to come back and shed some light, some truth on something. Or you guys want to come in and take action towards somebody that you may want a marriage or commitment out of. You guys could be consulting a high priestess, tapping into your high priestess, getting the justice. The universe is coming in there to help y'all. That's for sure. Whoever this breadcrumber is, whoever this argumentative person is that's bringing tower moments and stirring up a bunch of chaos. Spirit is about to get this shit handled, okay? Y'all don't have to worry about that. Yeah, but y'all feel like y'all hard struggle days is over with. Your struggle days of being unhappy and emotionally unstable is over with. So thank you, Scorpios. Peace, love, and light. That is all weekly for this week. Peace.